scoring in boards will pass you but scoring in ksat will save your future because that's what decide which college you will get what branch you will go to and whether if you get a high paying job or not also depends on your college because best colleges gets the best companies in their placement campus so balancing both ksat and boards is a very important thing and if you feel difficult then don't worry i'm here for you because i myself scored 100 out of 100 in mathematics in boards and also in physics and in ksat i got 135 marks and recently i got graduated from ms ramaya college with the highest package of 30 lakhs a year so you can definitely trust me so the first thing coming to the boards just imagine it's the easiest exam in your life because it is the easier one see i have gone through all the previous year papers and one thing i got to know is they repeat a lot they ask the same question same important question same topics again and again so i want you to go to big store today and buy a pyq of chapter wise of puc boards from at least last 5 years because after seeing every question you will understand oh this question is repeated 5 to 6 times and you will easily understand which are the most important topics which are the most important questions and in physics and mathematics i have seen they ask the same question with the same formula just with the different values so don't much stress on it and coming to the languages like english hindi or kannada whichever language you took you can easily cover them within just 2 to 3 days uh, before exam right and coming to the ksat i was struggling during my time because of lack of resources lack of awareness but today you have so much tools and resources for example call us those whatsapp bot in this you will get all the ksat resources preparation important topics they also have a 30 day study plan pdf and they also made rank versus marks pdf as well where you can understand for how much marks you can get how much ranking in your ksat and all of it is for free so i'll give the link in the description and also in the comment section you can check that out and they'll be also adding the 12th board resources as well soon so you can also get that advantage coming to how to manage both basically i say now focus on ksat and your college lecturers teachers will say focus on boards but your college centers will say focus on ksat so what to do so my opinion is to focus on the competitive exam that is ksat first because boards is very easy you can easily cover within 1 to 2 weeks or max to max 1 month so there are some unit tests for you uh, some practicals some labs so don't miss any of it just go and attend and when you come home from the college just focus on ksat you might have bought some courses or maybe some coaching materials so focus on that and as you will complete all the ksat one the boards will automatically get easier because in boards you just need to write you just need to write long answers with a good handwriting with a good diagrams derivation all those things so that will get easily covered from your ksat during february or march that time i want you to focus 50 50% 50% on boards 50% on ksat because your boards exam will be near and even if you get less marks in languages then don't worry because in ksat they consider only physics chemistry maths so if you get if you get more than 95 or 90 marks in that but your overall percentage of 12th is around 70% then it also doesn't matter because your pcm marks is the important one so the next upcoming videos i will also tell you which is the best uiq book for the 12th boards and also how to crack ksat in these remaining months and i also cracked neat so i will give my advice on that and you can ask your doubts in the comments and i will definitely make videos on it so i have planned to make every day video on youtube for you so that i can spread you the awareness of how to crack ksat boards mains or other competitive exams so stay tuned do subscribe if this was helpful and also check out the college those whatsapp board so that's it i will see you in the next video bye